Eden to the Lamb and the Boss Rush for a streak of 81. We get the Golden Teleport. We also get a Health Up, which means we have at least 2 HP. Uh, which is nice, because it's a Curse of the Unknown. So we don't actually see what's going on. We also have a Golden Remote. Which could be useful. Like... If we play our cards right here, we might be able to get a, a floor one boss rush here. Uh, a floor one devil deal, sorry. Charm of the Vampire is nice because as of Repentance, that's actually a damage up. Okay, now, we do not know how much HP we have. We don't know if we have a Soul Heart, which actually... Dang it. Which actually makes me kind of hesitant to go into that curse room. Dang it. Well, if we had a Soul Heart, it's gone now. Okay, we're gonna do this. We're gonna get this and see if it replenishes. Yeah, we can pick it up, so we we don't have soul hearts. That's good to know. We didn't start with a soul heart, never had one. Which means we have at least two heart containers, because it means we have to have started with one heart container. I want that, but I don't have a bomb. Okay, that's actually kind of bad. Okay, who thought this room was okay? At least once you get to the spawn limit, this is bearable. Yeah! Charm of the Vampire actually feasting in that room. <laughs> Give me a Squeezy. That's also fine. Squeezy would have given us tears up too. I want the golden chest. I don't want to go into the cursed room, so really using the golden remote doesn't seem that attractive. Well, let's go. Okay, another cursed room. Oh wow, we have all the health. <laughs> Alright, I was worried for nothing. Oh wait, but we had the... No wait, I lost the soul. I, I lost the eternal heart, right? So we actually started with three red hearts and then also got the health that we started with. Might go back for that curse room after we've done everything, if I can somehow guarantee myself an error room. This might be the floor to do it. Okay, Sloth is fine. Guy drops me a card or Bob's Rotten Head. I very much would care about a heart. Ow. Well. Bob's Rotten Head. El Toblerone! Thank you so much for two months of support. Appreciate it. Mm. Get it by these guys. Just Justice card, Hierophant card. Oh, yes. Okay, I forgot a scent in there. I saw it as I left, but I'm not going to go back in. You can guarantee an error room from the golden remote? Yes. Golden Remote always takes you to the next room on the map. If you use it, to the next unvisited room on the map. Um, and then if you visit every room, it, it goes in a certain priority, like item room, shop, then secret room, then super secret room, then devil deal. And if you've seen all those rooms on the map, it takes you to an error room. Alright, what do we got in here? Dead Sea Scrolls. And a set of flies for the second time. I'm gonna touch that to get it out of the, the pool.
in case we go angel rooms in this run, which seems rather unlikely with four red hearts. Sniper, thanks for the good luck. Dang it, where's the door? Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Can I use Bomb Dude here? Nice, I can. Eesh. Okay, don't care about mom's bottle of pills. Mom's coin purse, sorry. But I do care about the soul heart. This floor is getting a bit time intense. Um, boss rush needs to happen on a timer. And we're already seven minutes along. Oh, finding the super secret room on this floor seems like a hoot and a half. Actually, is it to my right? It's gotta be to my right, right? Actually, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just here. Nope. And then it's here, right? All right, sweet. So yeah, after we beat the boss and go to the Devil Deal, this golden remote should be taking us to... Um, should be taking us to an error room. Oh god. I've read through this video prompts and I haven't disagreed with you once probably because I've watched you play an ungodly amount of hours in Isaac. <laughs> There's actually things in the tier list at this point because the video was made like five months or so ago, right? There's probably, or there's definitely things in this tier list at this point that I don't agree with anymore. But not a whole lot. All right, safety pin is nice. I'm okay with Gimpy popping that once. And that gets me to an error room now, which is... I mean, acid tears are nice. Oh no. Did I put DSS too far? Wait, what is DSS? Still salty about quarter over dollar, Bell. I gave my reasoning very much for that in the tier list, though. A Dead Sea Scrolls. <laughs> yeah, I definitely misevaluated that. Okay, I think I'm not actually gonna take the time to full clear this. I'm just gonna try and find the item room and the store and then move on. Because otherwise this is gonna take forever. I sure have a lot of HP. Well, that is... What is it with the dimes from fires today? Spider mod would be good here. Oh, please ask Twitch chat. Spider mod would always be good. In fact, spider mod is always the best item to find. Mini pins, mini pins. Little Gertie is okay. Yeah, now that I know how to guarantee your crawl space from the shovel, I would definitely rate it higher. Like, much higher. Shovel is a really good item. Okay. Fallen! My man! Oh, 
Oh, look at Gertie. Going in. Remember when this channel had a Gertie Jr. emote? Or little Gertie emote? Whatever. Lord of the Pit is actually okay. What time are we at? 12.11. Okay, I was about to say we gotta hurry a bit, and then we ran into a mid-boss. Can I murder these guys while playing the donation machine at the same time? Because I would like to have some money from that. I'm gonna skip this room. I didn't get acid tears for nothing, right? You gotta be using them. Okay. Oh, nice. We love to see it. Doggo tooth. Doggo Tooth with the uh, Acid Tears is actually incredibly helpful. I don't think I care about the... the coupon. Ha! <laughs> he jumped into the fire. Idiot. There's some pretty nutty min-maxing to be done here. There's some pretty nutty min-maxing to be done here with that blood donation machine. But it takes too long. Dude, I'm so fast now. Now give me Lump of Coal. Although I would take... I would take Mega Satan Head too. Or cramp said whatever. I would take Krampusad too. Any anything that makes me go faster. Krampusad is actually pretty nutty in the boss rush. And with how much we need to hurry, there's actually almost no way that we're gonna be utilizing that golden remote to its full potential anymore. Yeah, sure. Nice pork champ face. At least the old one. <laughs> well, there's the delirium backup win. We don't need a delirium backup win. Come on. We're making this boss rush. Maybe. We're gonna have to cut some corners for it potentially, but we're gonna make this boss rush. It's a lamb run too, so I don't need to look for the fool's card. If I did, I wouldn't have used it on the challenge room. Probably don't have time to look for the item room on this floor, though. Not gonna lie. See, this is some of the things that can happen with this challenge, for those of you who are watching for the first time now, inevitably. Um, sometimes you just get forced into these largely uncomfortable positions. Oh, 
Oh, there we go. That's my ticket to getting a fast next floor. What? Uh, okay, Halo Flies is very good. Don't care about these. Come on. Mm, give me an acid tier. time for that <laughs> what no this guy takes forever <laughs> the wall of magdalene Oh, dude, this is going to be so close. I didn't anticipate the cage. Okay. Pageant boy, not great. I'm not even going to pick up the money. Whatever. Oh my god, this floor is gigantic. The problem isn't just the floor being gigantic, but also the fact that I'm gonna have to beat mom's foot in like one minute with this build. Oh my God, there's a crawl space here and I can't go for it. <laughs> Did that have to be Chubb? Okay, keep making him charge so he doesn't summon any ads. And then hope that we can somehow beat Mom's foot in a minute. No! Especially if mom doesn't even show up. Are we going to delirium? <laughs> We're going to delirium. That cage fight really did me in. Yeah, that's that's boss rush gone. Okay, so I have a I have a, a cop out rule for this. I feel the need to explain this since there's a lot of time a lot of first time viewers here. I have a cop out rule for a, a run like this, where if I cannot reach the run goal or if I mess up in some capacity, I can redeem the run by going to delirium instead, which is the hardest boss in the game. Now, not being able to reach the boss rush typically means that the run isn't all too good. Oh, wow. Okay, that's really good. If we can get it. But I'm gonna try my best to, uh, to get it going. Delirium is a 30 minute timer to Mom's Heart, which is the boss two floors from here. And while that sounds pretty difficult to be thrown into another speed run like that right off the bat, it's actually quite a bit easier. There's a mid boss on the floor, but I'm not sure I want to clear that big room. I definitely want to go to the item room. I think that's worth it under each and every circumstance. I mean, that's very worth it. Oh, that room is just empty. Yeah, we're definitely going to the store then. Hey, that was just in the machine. I'm gonna take that actually.
Okay, let's go. Crawl space was this floor, but at this point I don't care. Doggo also didn't go off again there. Yeah, I don't know why. Maybe because we had already beaten the boss. I've never seen that happen either. kill these we gotta find some rewards too because keys are gonna be key because we're gonna need a lot of those for the for the hush floor seven to be exact is where we want to be at the end of this so i should be clearing the faster to clear rooms like that one oops peanut rock down here i want that because small rock would be insane don't care about the walnut, don't care about these guys because they take forever. Okay, well, we know where the secret room is. And probably the super secret too. Lighter is actually kind of solid. Soul of Cain. Actually kind of good. It's actually nice that we don't have to worry about the spikes here because we're flying. Everything else is actually kind of tame about this boss to be honest. Okay, range is okay. Oh, that's insane. Okay, that's a very good find. Aya Belial gives us piercing and the tier of a damage doubles now when it travels through an enemy. That's solid. I don't know why I decided to clear this room, but we have we have plenty of time at this point. Six minutes is a lot for Wumto. That last floor really made up for it. Being so slow so far. I think I'm just gonna pop Soul of Cain here. We got two sack rooms from that, interesting. Actually, this one couldn't have led to the Ultra Secret, I'm pretty sure, but the one at the top can, potentially. Okay, no Ultra Secret for us. <laughs> one key and a dream. I should clear some rooms for a potential key, huh? I mean, that gives you a key on pickup, so that's neat. Super Secret isn't here, that's unfortunate. I can clear some rooms here, we have time. We have a bit of time. We should. that but that works I guess imagine a bombs are key pal my single target damage is still pretty abysmal my room clear got a lot better with that Aya Belial. Yeah, see, like, those mobs aren't an issue whatsoever. At least the ads from Hush aren't gonna be too bad. And then we have plenty of time to try and improve, so... If we can beat Hush.
No devil deal because that'd be too too easy. Am I right? All right, we got three keys at least, which is enough to go to the two item rooms and the store. And then the store can also contain a key, which it ended up not doing. Oh, we can play that actually for keys. Because all the, ooh, nice. All the time stuff is over now. All the time stuff is over now, so we can, we can min max to our heart's content. That's nice. Um, Leech actually seems pretty solid. Maybe I can find some health ups. The world. Hey, look, there's my crawl space. <laughs> IBS. Okay. And a pill. No keys here. I'm really tempted to pop the pills for a bombs are key, but I don't think that's worth it. All right, we should be able, we should be equipped to beat Hush. That's nice, at least. Worst Hush pattern ever. Actually, this is nowhere near as bad. It really only sucks when he fires uh, or when he summons a bunch of enemies and then goes into the purple wavy attack, that one. Then it's really bad. Other than that, everything is actually manageable. Like, I, I took a bunch of dumb hits in that fight, but that was my fault. And then we're gonna go into the floor where we need a ton of help to be able to succeed. Hey, okay, that's a good one. Jumper cables. I mean, I don't know, if we get a better space use item, maybe that's useful, but right now that doesn't really do anything for me saving me some HP there. Just give me 4.5 volt and it's over. <laughs> if you're wondering, by the way, how I know where Delirium can and can't be, well, might as well. Where Delirium can and can't be, I have a guide for that up on YouTube. You can search up how to find Delirium on the void floor on YouTube. To get that guide, you can also type exclamation point delirium in chat if you're watching on Twitch to get a link to it. And if you're watching this on YouTube, then there's going to be a link in the comments or, or the video description, probably both. All right, let's go for it. I'm glad all the mushrooms got destroyed immediately. How hilarious would it have been if a magic mushroom came out of that? Okay, we're... Oh, you ass -ass. We're obviously gonna save the book charge um, for when he gets faster. Because the early game, at least, uh, is, is like somewhat reasonable to dodge. Aside from the guaranteed hits, of course. Like... Can't really stop the the idiot from spawning tears on top of me. Jesus. Really glad that Mama Gertie is in the pool. <laughs> and that he's transforming into her so often. <laughs> Hello? Oh. Alright, time to take unavoidable damage. Nope. 
What is this? A mellow delirium fight? I can't believe it. Because it's not happening. We're not even halfway done yet. Like, he's gonna go ham. At some point. Any minute now, chat. He's gonna go ham. Well, to be fair, I never said I was going to beat him headless. <laughs> I do keep an eye on my health, but I really want to use that book as late as possible. Man, this transformation is kind of rude, not going to lie. Transforming into a media charge attack? Kind of mean. Okay, I need to shut up. Oh, you don't teleport on top of me. Hell of a streak. Hell of a streak, but like... We didn't have good single target damage. <laughs> <laughs> 